Hey guys, this is Steve with Tronix Fix. You may have watched our video about the Nintendo Switch temperature testing in handheld mode. Today we're going to do the testing in docked mode. As many of you probably already know, there's been a lot of reports of Nintendo Switches overheating when in docked mode, having other problems, glitching and stuff like that. So we're going to do four hours of testing on this to see how it does. So right now it's 7.43 in the morning. We're gonna play the Nintendo Switch in docked mode for four hours, and then we'll come back and test the temperature. So here we are after playing Zelda Breath of the Wild for four hours and 22 minutes or so. So far, I've been checking the temperature throughout my gameplay, and so far the high temperature has been 98 degrees or 35 degrees Celsius. We're gonna test it one more time here. We're right at a shrine, as you can tell, and that at least for my testing, that has been the most, uh, most heat it's been putting out. We do have a maximum of 107 degrees Fahrenheit and a maximum of 42 degrees Celsius. I did go ahead and hook up my wattage meter as well, and you can see that over on that side of the TV. So those are the current watts that the Nintendo Switch is putting out. You can see it's quite a power sipper. It doesn't use very much power while it's playing. Definitely not nearly as much as one of the larger consoles. So while this Nintendo Switch does definitely get warm, it's not anything like I've heard about. I've heard quite a few people saying that there's overheats and there's glitches out. I've had no glitching on mine, definitely not in docked mode, but I have heard a few people complaining about that. This one works fine. It stays nice and cool while playing, so hopefully yours are doing the same, but we will definitely keep you updated if we notice any overheating problems with our Nintendo Switch. If you happen to have an overheating switch, definitely send it back for warranty repairs if possible. If you're outside of warranty, you can always send it in to us here at Tronix Fix. We do replace thermal paste. We can fix your fan, whatever needs to be done to make it so it cools normally. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions and thanks for hanging out with me today.